Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Tony with Backwoods Biker again. Mission 56 Battle Box is here, and you'll want to see this one. All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, you know, we've always got something good to say about BattleBox uh, just because of the simple facts that you get more bang for your buck with BattleBox than anybody else. And as if you've been following the channel or reading the magazine, you know that we have been working with them for this past year, all of 2019, uh, reviewing boxes every month. And because of that, you know, and all the folks that read the magazine, um, we've had several other companies reach out and send us, you know, their boxes without us requesting it, wanting us to uh, get, get involved with them. Uh, and to this point, we have not found anybody anywhere that has the value and the quality of gear that BattleBox does. That's why we've hung with them, and that's why we're going to continue working with them, because until they show us something different, again, they are the only ones that we can recommend. So this month, 56, is a little bit special, and I'm going to be able to show you why here. Uh, but we're going to get started right away. As always, they've got four tiers, the Basic, the Advanced, the Pro, and the Pro Plus. Um, and you can, you can get in at the Basic at $29.95, go up to the Pro Plus for $149.95, but it doesn't matter which tier you get in. You're always going to double your money, your value. Let's say uh, you're going to get into the $29 uh, bracket, okay? You're going to get at least $58 to $60, even more than that in value of a gear. And you're going to see that in just a second. So with that being said, let's just get this ball rolling, all right? There are four items in this month's basic box. Uh, it starts off with the Hellfire Bushcraft Stainless Steel Grill Set. And they give this a value of $19.99. It comes in this... Hellfire Bushcraft Grill Wax Canvas Bag. Now anything that's in wax canvas to me is just awesome. If for whatever reason I decide that I want to discard these or I wear them out, this bag will last a lifetime if I take care of it. Okay, I can use it for other stuff. I'm already brainstorming as to what I can use it, but for now, let's just look at these awesome little grills. Now I've been asked before what do I take out for a grill and the answer is I don't take out a grill. Um, you know I'll, I'll make my own uh, grill out of uh, you know timber, wood, whatever um, but these I would take out. The reason I've never taken out a grill is because the ones that I've, I've found or the ones that have been submitted to us have either been cheaply put together, they're flimsy, or they've got a bazillion freaking pieces that you got to put together, you know. And uh, when you're out in the bush uh, after a, a long day of, of working and humping and doing whatever you're doing, bushcrafting, putting stuff together, hunting, I don't feel like putting together uh, a, a camp stove or whatever, you know. Uh, so that's why I've shied, shied away from them. That's number one. Number two is that they've been too big, uh, not very packable overweight or whatever that I didn't want to mess with. But this one from Hellfire, they, they've come in really good. First of all, it's made from heavy-duty stainless steel. This stuff is really, really awesome. And although it does not come with legs, you really don't need them. Uh, the way that, that uh, we have uh, worked with these, uh, let me see, three different ways. Uh, number one, uh, we built a rock ring with a keyhole. Fits right on there cook anything you want. They clean up very, very easy. Uh, the second way that I did it was I put it on four um, legs made out of uh, bushcraft tent pegs. That's what they look like. Um, and if you worry about burning them, use green wood. It won't burn. Uh, your food is going to be done before the wood starts to burn. Easy cleanup. Then you throw the sticks in the fire and you're continuing putting fuel in the fire. The other way, which was inspired by Curran 1776 on the Battle Box YouTube channel, uh, Curran sawed a kerf into a tree, which 
you know, I'm not going to do that, but that's, that's you know, current. Uh, and he slipped this inside here, but it, it gives us an idea here. So what we did is we cut down a two foot by three inch uh, sapling. We sharpened the edge of it and we drove it in the ground till it was sturdy. And then we cut saw kerfs at about six inches, 10 inches, and about 15 inches and put them in there. Made it very, very portable that you could move that. That's what I would recommend you do. <clears throat> And when you do, you got a a, a sustainable uh, cook space, you know. And if you do that, you can also stack them, you know, and cook that way. So this is a great ad for $19.99 value. I love it. Love the fact that it is in a wax canvas case. I'm going to sit that off to the side over here. The next thing is a book. This is the Camp Cooking Practical Handbook by Fred Bauman. Um... And you can find this on Amazon. You can find it on several different websites. Um, but uh, Bauman has covered every angle from meat, um, fish, vegetables, mushrooms, how to prepare, how to cook, you know, uh, the fireside bakery. You know, this would be for somebody that is really into heavy gear, you know, taking stuff out like... Um, uh, not um, cast iron, you know, uh, Dutch ovens, things like that, you know. Uh, but I think it's a cool ad because anytime you can put a book in your library, you've got some corn in your crib. Now they give this a value of twelve ninety five, but when we went out on Amazon at that time, we couldn't find it for any less than sixteen ninety nine. Um, so that's you know it's a four dollar value there. Uh, but we also found it on some websites for as high as $22. So this is a great bargain, adding a book to your library, putting some corn in your crib. All right, the next one here is from Grenade Soap Company. This is called the Claymore Soap Napalm. Uh, for you military guys, you know that uh, the Claymore, the M18, was a bad mofo. It was one of my favorite things to play with. I just wish they'd let me have some now, but they won't let me have a Claymore. You know, it's just no fun sometimes. But this is like a soap on a stainless steel lanyard that comes apart here. See that, how that come apart? And it fits right down there, but you got to poke a hole in that, I think. There you go, look at that. And that goes together like this. And then it just screws back on there again. Got to have that thing up there, though. But here's, here's where I'm at. I saw Curran, you know, he was all jacked up. Uh... You know, Brandon, he he was he was all jacked up with this soap here. But I got to tell you, Brandon, this isn't some type of soap that I'd want to put on my body. Now I might hang this up in my shower, okay? Uh, but out in the bush, I don't want to smell like foo foo. I don't want to smell like some girly girl out there. And this is like girly girl smell soap here. So great idea. I like the way it looks and all that. I'll hang it up in my shower and my wife can use it. How's that? But they give this a value of $8.99. Uh, and that's exactly what we found it for on the website. So there's a good ad to you there if you like that type of stuff. All right. Uh, then the last thing in the basic box is a hat. It isn't a tactical hat, really, but it's from 511, 511. Uh, and everything you get from, from 511 is going to be top notch. Uh, I've got some pants and maybe a shirt or two uh, from them. But uh, that is the hat right there. Be sporting that dude. Um, 511 Tacticals, what it says, establish an 03. Nice little logo on the front there. They give this a value of $18.99. And that's one of the things that you'll find about, about uh, 511 Tactical. They're not cheap. Uh, but they're not cheaply made either, you know, so that's a good half for $18.99. That brings the value of this to $60.92, over twice what you have invested in this. And that's the way BattleBox does in every tier. So the next one is the Advanced Tier. They give this a value of $104.86, okay, because you build on every tier as you go. The first thing is a TravelChair.com slacker tripod stool all right you ever been out in the bush and you looked around 
you're trying to sit down or you're going to be doing some type of hunting, whether it's squirrel hunting, you know, get up early in the morning, you don't want to sit on the ground, bam, bingo, right here it is. This is one bad mofo chair. Um, I barely get it up in this shot here, but you can see it, you know, it is awesome. Uh, I've sat in this thing and it is sturdy. It's made out of a heavy duty canvas and nylon. And I believe these poles are aluminum. It's not very heavy at all, uh, but it's a heavy duty made chair. And they give this a value of $23.95. You go to their website, that's what you're going to find it for. But I found this chair, other areas, uh, that was almost $40, the same type of chair, you know. But that's, that's a great ad right there. And then uh, the next thing here, which is was so impressive to me. Man, this, this is the bomb here. This is from Forge uh, Thermoplastic. Uh, Forge is the name of the company, F-O-R-J. Uh, and this is a thermoplastic tape that you can heat and shape to whatever uh, dimension or geometric form that you would like. Um, and I would encourage you to go on BattleBox's YouTube channel and look at BattleBox Mission 56 and see what they do with this. I don't have a kitchen down here and I am not going to start a fire in the studio here. Okay. I don't have sprinklers down here, all right? But this is what it looks like. It is a thermoplastic. Oh, it, it, you know what it looks like to me? It looks like fiberglass because it's got lines running through this. But you cut it to length, and then you heat it. And after you have heated it, and you can heat it with a like a, a, a lighter, cigar torch, uh, over fire, or even in boiling water, you shape it to whatever you want to use it for. Um, on on the on their YouTube channel, BattleBox guys made a chain link out of it, and then they towed a truck with it. I am not blowing you in smoke. That's the truth. Check out the channel. This stuff uh, can fix anything that ails you, and I was very impressed with this. And we've been brainstorming as to what we can do uh, with this ourselves. So that is a great ad. They give that a value of $19.99, and that's exactly what we found it. Uh, for itself, um, we were actually wondering, um, you know, can you make a cast out of this? That's how hard it gets. It gets like iron. And now putting this off to the side, I see on the back here it says first aid, uh, belting splints, cast, shin, form, and wrist guards, custom fit shoe liner, uh, chafe wrapping. Wow, a lot of stuff you can do with that. That's $19.99 for that. And that brings the value of this box to $104 and 86 cents. 59.99 is uh, the price of the advanced tier. So again, you're doubling your, your, your money just about. So then that takes us to the pro level. And I really got excited about this because I saw this product at a knife and gun show. Matter of fact, two knife and gun shows, I saw two different dealers have these. And uh, I was watching them use them. I was very, very impressed with this. But in this Pro Box is the V-Sharp Classic 2 Knife Sharp. Okay? Now, when you look at it like that, it is, doesn't look really sexy or anything like that. You know, a lot of guys uh, I saw trying to figure out how to use this, they were overthinking it. You know, but this is a great little knife sharpener. I'll show you right here. Let me turn this around for from my left-handed holding and all you do is put your knife in push it down and pull you see that how that just and it, it, it keeps everything perfect right just put that right up against there pull it does both sides of the knife all you gotta do is keep it up against that portion right here as you're pulling it through now I've been cutting cardboard with this all day long and I thought to myself, I was doing it, man, I'm going to have to sharpen my knife. And let me get a piece of paper here. Just something that we can fool around with. I mean, that is sharp and it was dull before I started. Now, they give this a value of $84.99. Uh, and we took pictures and we took notes at the gun show on things that was, looked cool to us. We saw these for as high as $120. Uh, 
and they've got it here. They give it a value of eighty-four ninety-nine, and this is the ninety-nine dollar level. Well, the pro um, level cost you ninety-nine bucks, and it's a hundred eighty-nine dollar value. I mean, again, you you just can't beat the value that you get and the quality of stuff. I mean, this is not some cheap sharpener. But through them, you get it at a great price, reduced what you normally would just about anywhere else. So that's the Pro level. And that takes us quickly to the Pro Plus, which is the knife of the month, $149.99 every month. And this knife, I got it out of the box. It is by Willemson of Copenhagen, all right? They call this the Despot Large. Um, I'll just I'll just read this to you here. Um, it's a fixed blade, um, 3D milled G10 textured handle, 120 millimeter OS 8 steel blade, sheath included. It says King of the Game. The Despot knife is a slender fixed blade with attitude, ideal for challenging cutting tasks and sturdy materials. The game knife features nicely rounded handle with lanyard hole for a steady grip at all times. Keep your despot at the ready with a sturdy molly compatible sheath. All right, blah, blah, blah. All right. So this is a guide. It also comes with this sheath right here. Um, you know, I've said this before. If you're going to spend money on a, on a good knife, putting a good knife together, put a good sheath with it also. I'm not real crazy about the sheath, but I'm going to tell you something. The knife itself... I am very impressed with this little guy. Fits perfectly in the hand. I love the shape of it. And as you know, um, when you're talking about a survival knife, a bushcraft knife, I don't like a great big long blade. You know, this here is, is the perfect size. It fits in my hand. This is the Aus 8 again. Uh, the jimping on it, eh, a little hot, but I mean, I could just really take a piece of sandpaper to that and bring it down to where I want it. I think too many guys are overthinking uh, the weight of a knife. You know, they want it to be heavy. You know, they think the heavier the better, and that's not true. You know, uh, this knife will, will serve you well out in the bush wherever you're at. Uh, would I do anything different with it? I might try to sharpen up that spine a little bit. I haven't tried it with a ferro rod. Uh, it might work, it might not, but it'd be easy to remedy that. But, wow, what a nice box okay just let me show you something here okay if all you got was the v-sharp and the knife you're well ahead of game anyway you know as i said 120 bucks if even if you went down to the lowest number that they have 84 dollars for that and then 124 dollars for this you're already over 200 dollars and all you paid was 149 but instead of just these two things you get everything I just showed you here for $149. Great box this month, Battle Box. Mission 56 is dope. Appreciate it. And I'm sure that our readers are going to appreciate it too. Uh, we're not done yet. As always, there's always something in here in regards to redeemable gift cards. Uh, this one is uh, for buy four tens and get the fifth free of the Forge tape. You know, we may take advantage of that. Uh... They've got all kinds of stuff. They got, they, they're showing them building a hitch pin. I don't know if you can see that up there. Can you see that hitch pin that's on that card? Yeah, they build a hitch pin set out of that stuff. Cool. All right. And then the other card is buy any soap using promo code, blah, 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 and get a free. Come on. I don't even if I want to read this. You get a free taint scrubber. Are you kidding me? Hmm. You got to have a scrubber now for your taint? Well, you do with this box. So, uh, i got a couple things that I do want to tell you since uh, this kind of went a little bit faster than normal. Is that we've got a special edition coming out in December. It's going to have a lot of uh, great articles in it. And one of the articles is the best of Battle Box of every month. We're going to take the best two pieces of gear out of every box in 2019 and highlight it for you so you can see what we think about it. All right? Appreciate you watching the video. I love our subscribers. I appreciate all your help and your support. If you'd like to become a subscriber and receive free gear, click that button down there, that subscribe button off to your lower right, and then share it. Put it on Facebook. 
and, and email us right there at Tony at BackwoodsBiker.com and we will be sure to put you in our database monthly drawings. We give away knives, we give away uh, fire kits, we give away bush butter, we give away a lot of stuff. So become a subscriber, share it and like it, tell your friends about it. Until next time, you guys ride free, you live free and as always, you be safe out there.